Batman's hilarious new bat signal reveals how silly the original really is. However, Dylan and his Scotland Yard associate, Inspector Block, face a dilemma when they realize they lack a means to reach the caped crusader. This prompts Block to contact Commissioner Gordon, who provides instructions on how to reach Batman. Batman's new London-based bat signal looks more like a mortally wounded duck. One of the neatest quirks about Batman is that all his gadgets and thingamajigs are preceded by bat, adding to his overall theme. This includes his iconic bat signal that Commissioner Gordon shines into the Gotham night sky to call upon the Dark Knight's help. However, Batman's newest night sky beacon emphasizes just how absurd the whole concept of the bat signal truly is. Batman slash Dylan Dog Number 1, crafted by Roberto Recchioni, Gigi Cavanago, Werther De Lettera, and Giovanna Nero, presents a brilliant crossover uniting Gotham's Dark Knight and the Italian comics hero, Dylan Dog in London to combat the threat posed by Joker and the sinister Dr. Zavaros. Following Gordon's instructions, Block constructs a bat signal on the top of the Scotland Yard headquarters, illuminating the sky in hopes of catching Batman's attention. However, as Dylan Dog and Block wait on the roof for the Dark Knight to arrive, Dylan candidly remarks that the bat signal looks, more like a mortally wounded duck. Block defends his creation, stating it was the best he could manage with the available resources in the office. Despite the signal's questionable resemblance to a bat, Bruce recognizes its purpose and responds promptly to the call. This comical interpretation of the bat signal injects a touch of reality, highlighting the inherent absurdity of the iconic beacon. When Gordon initially instructed Block on how to summon Batman, the inspector's genuine surprise and disbelief were entirely justified. Over time, both residents of Gotham and comic enthusiasts have become accustomed to the peculiar practice of official figures communicating with a cryptid-like vigilante by illuminating the night sky with a symbol of his preferred creature. Hence, this bat signal in London offers a light-hearted critique of the concept without outright condemning it.